everybody! Hello, hello, hello! I am so excited. I feel like I have been away from YouTube far too long. I haven't been able to keep up with the videos, let alone film, and um, it's just been crazy. And I miss all of you, and I wanted to share. If you don't follow me on Instagram, um, you don't already know, I finally caved in and hopped on to the Filofax community. It's like the Filofax craze and it's contagious. So I would not um, advise I would not advise this because it is super contagious and it's another expensive hobby is what I'm be I've been seeing on YouTube. And um, I did check out the website and yes, I picked out the less expensive one because I already use a humongous agenda for work um, to keep up with the student curriculum but so I thought oh I just want something small for my purse and so I picked the this gorgeous pink domino pocket domino and you know what it's really tiny <laughs> I know I should have read the measurements it's like the size of my hand it's so tiny um, and I love it I just love playing with it and you know what, I've been watching these videos, especially Nadine, you guys know she is a humongous enabler. And I just love playing with it and decorating it. So I started decorating it with what I am into right now, which is the gorgeous, the gorgeous girls. So that's what I did. I did not put in my personal information in this. All it's holding is like two cards, that's it. Um, but it's not going to ask, replace my wallet because it's just kind of scary. Not only that, but I actually, I'm glad I didn't because last night I forgot this at work inside um, my uh, notebook case. So that was pretty scary. But even though the classroom is locked, you know, the janitor still goes in there and they sometimes let other students in there in the morning. And I don't know. So I did the gorgeous girls. And... You know, it's it's not um, super decorated yet. Hopefully I will get there. I use one of the Prima clips here. This is the butterfly one to hold that in place. Just have two, my, two of my go-to cards. And of course, my Starbucks, even though I have the app, but it's there. And I did create some of these leaves. I know the Filofax comes with one already. And I altered these little tabs here, made a little charm. And you guys know what? I actually took my Eiffel Tower charm out of the hoarding vault. And it fell in my purse and I thought, no way, I'm not losing this Eiffel Tower. It's going back in the vault. So I replaced it with this heart. And this is very shabby chic um, charm. And it just hangs here. So when you can see it when it's closed. It's just makes me happy and here's another gorgeous girl and of course I use my favorite paper Prima and this is the Rondell collection I use the paper pack Jen gave me and this is the back I use an Eiffel Tower die of course I have to include my Eiffel Tower and then I included these little tags that are stuck together <laughs> gorgeous girl tags never know when you might need a little tag there and I'm loving these little magnetic closures I don't know if you can see them I got these we went to little Tokyo last weekend and I've only had this Filofax for about two weeks now and um, I got these at uh, I don't have the store name right now but it's in little Tokyo and these are some Japanese dolls they're super super adorable so that's what I'm using and then throughout the notebook you're going to see little stickies it's also Japanese dolls brand which I totally totally love and oh the store's name is Kinokuniya Kinokuniya so if you're from LA you should pay them a visit except everything there is so expensive as you can see these were $8.99 
and these don't have a price. There is this gorgeous pen that I wanted, but you guys, it was like $11 for this pen. I know we're paying the overseas fee, but holy moly, that was expensive. I just couldn't say no to these though. And um, I started decorating some of my pages with washi tape. This is the week I got it. And we had gone to Filofax that weekend. I received this on Saturday and Sunday when we were there I started picking up goodies. So I didn't mean to go crazy on buying things for Filofax because you know it took me forever. Plus I use my reminders on my iPhone and I ignore them. So I was just like eh, this is not going to do me any good. But you really do get addicted to trying to decorate these little guys. Um. Here is my first week agenda, and I just use a little stamp there. I created a Jeopardy game for my classroom, which is a lot of fun. And I know I've seen some of the Filofax videos, and they go week by week. Maybe I'll jump on board with that. So far, my life is not that interesting. So all I have here is usually just soccer practice. The girls' gymnastics has not started yet. Started yet. So um, you know, court sessions and some to-do lists around the house and then you guys I made strawberry jello shots strawberry margarita shots for um, hearts and crafts for tea it was her birthday on Saturday and they were a hit and it's an amazing recipe super simple and super delicious and we did take family portraits that I did um, share some on Instagram and Facebook if you're there and um, this is our current week. Here's my ruler. I know I have seen some fabulous rulers on your videos. I have not been able to do anything yet with this. So hopefully I'll get to that soon. Maybe bling it out. And um, this week is kind of busy. It's cr pretty crazy. <laughs> so I was telling Caesar, I, I don't understand. Everybody's getting multiple organizers, right? And so yesterday, I started filling out my agenda and I thought, okay, this is bad because now I want a bigger Filofax. You know, I shouldn't have cheaped out in the first place. And I told him, I need another Filofax. He's like, oh no, you've been contaged. And so I guess I have been contaged because, I mean, look at this, this page. It's like, let's see, the iPhone, it's, the page is like the size of the iPhone, you guys. You, you write down two tasks and you pretty much took up the whole page. <laughs> so it's super small. So that's what I'm trying to fight for right now. We went on site and we saw some alligator skin Filofax that was like $2,000, like $2,300. And there was some, um, I guess, uh, lizard skin, $800. And then I saw the most common one, I guess, which is $90. And, uh, so we'll see. We'll see. Hopefully, I'm not. That doesn't contage too bad. Um, then we have our three-day weekend so far for that week, and that's all I've had there so far. Just enjoyed today. A little stamp there and some washi tape. Some of my favorite washi tape. And I tried decorating for the rest of the month, but that's pretty much it. And I just have some to-do things here and there, but. So that's pretty much it for my life. <laughs> and then I created some more of these uh, fly leaves and put some of my tags there. And I listed some of the green teas, my favorite teas, I'm sorry, my favorite teas over at Starbucks, which is another expense that I just started getting into as well. <laughs> and here's another gorgeous girl. And peekaboo, another gorgeous girl with some more rondelle paper, both of these. And I took out most of 2014 here because this thing is so darn small that it was hard turning the pages because of, you know, I don't know. I haven't even added anything and it was already hard. So I took out the rest of 2014, just kept like the first two months there. And then here I use this gorgeous paper. It's uh, Best Creations. And it's super glimmery. Um, shimmery, sorry. I love this paper. 
And here on the back, same paper. And I included a gorgeous girl. Here are some of my notes. And there's another fly leaf here where I stuck these little stickies on. And these again were the Japanese dolls. And I love them. They're super cute. And there's another Prima clip. This is the music note. Best Creations line. And there's another gorgeous girl. And here's some of the We Are Memory Keepers Project Life notepads that Colleen sent me over in my last rock that I have not finished filming. So I include that, included some of those here. It's memories and to-do list. And there's another fly leaf with these stickies. And more stickies and another little tab. It says live simply, love deeply. And then there's another Prima clip here. Some notes. And then this last, these last two tabs, I, last tab, sorry. I used some of the engagement paper that I have been hoarding from Bella Boulevard. I'm waiting to take our engagement pictures, so hopefully I can use this. And uh, yes, I did go ahead and cut piece out for this and stick some of these stickies on there and I love it it says little black dress sexy teen bride with her bride to be and then this is the other side of that paper with the peekaboo gorgeous girl and here are some business cards from hearts and crafts and there's a picture there that I do not want to show. And another magnetic closure. And I have not gotten to these yet. Hopefully I will get to those soon. Because this ugly manila color, I'm not feeling it. And I purchased two of these over at the Little Tokyo store. And these were actually like $4 for both of them. For a pack. Actually, there's a pack of four. I didn't put all four in here so that was pretty deal. It was like four dollars for a pack of four so it ended up to be a dollar each and I have some more um, extra gorgeous girl tabs in case I want to stick some in somewhere and I have a receipt here and a gift card and some receipts there that's pretty much it super simple I did buy a really cute pen but it didn't fit in this little thing this little loop here not only is the organizer small, but the little loop is really tiny. And um, so I left that one at work. Right now I'm using this colorful, ginormous pen. Even though it's short, it's just, it won't fit there. I wonder if I can hang it. You think I should just hang it? Yeah, guys. Check out my awesome organizer. <laughs> With this ginormous pen hanging out. <laughs> Okay, so that's pretty much it. I was super excited. I really wanted to share this with you guys and warn you guys if you guys are thinking about jumping on board with this Filofax thing, you know, the pocket domino is, it's really cute, really convenient to have in your bag. It's just, um, if you do more than two things a day, it's not going to fit in there. <laughs> I'm exaggerating. It probably fits like, you know, a couple. It's just like, cluttered all around. Um, maybe I'm just finding excuses. You see that? Probably just finding excuses to get a bigger one, but um, this is just to give you guys a taste of what it looks like kind of decorated. And um, I don't know, maybe you'll see me with the bigger one. Keep posted. All right. Bye, guys.